Um, I'm Adrian and I'm a photography major. I'm Ben. I'm Noah. My name is Tyler. My name is Emmy Larson. I'm a fabric styling major. I'm an illustration major. Yeah, thank you for having me. Hey guys, what's up? And welcome back to my zine, your digital fashion magazine. Today we are back with one of your favorite videos, a what fashion students are wearing in New York City. I went to my usual fashion college, it's my favorite one because they have an open campus so I can interview everyone, which is FIT. And I was asked them what's on their wish list so we can get some ideas of like what's gonna be trendy and what they wanna buy. So yeah, I hope you guys like this. Make sure to give me some video ideas in the comments down below. And thank you, Skillshare, for sponsoring this video, but more on that later. Um, I'm Adrian and I'm a photography major. Oh. Yeah, it's my okay. first year. Um, today I have creative approaches, which is kind of more of the like, I guess, artistic side of photography. Uh, I feel like I just have to like put in more effort um, all the time. I've, I've started wearing a lot more jewelry because I never wore jewelry before. These are mostly from Etsy and then this one I got at like a vintage store. This one I got at like a flea market. I need new platforms. I need new shoes. Just got these. I Those, those were on my wish list. My really? Outfit. I love them. <laughs> Thank you. I'm Ben. I'm a fashion business management major. I'm Noah and I'm also a fashion business management major. First year, we're freshmen. My old school had kind of a dress code so now I can wear more of what I want to wear. And I'm kind of, I guess, inspired by the people around me, but not too inspired. Because <laughs> I need to be different. <laughs> I think the stakes are higher being an FIT because like, I think I could get away in high school with like having one day where I'm not really trying, but like I feel like I have to try every, every single day. day. Yeah, that too. So now I have to like pull through with an outfit every single day. I mean, I've been like on the hunt for like a good fur vest. Mm, okay. I really want a fur vest. Like either, I don't even know, like like a brown one. One that looks kind of feathery, that would be cool too. Like, you know, the ones, like the indie sleeves, like late 2000s, early 2010s, like club vest thing that people would just like layer over like a bra. This is like reminiscent of like the punk subculture. I really want like a leather like motorcyclist hat that has like the embellishments, like the spikes on it. Like I just need more headwear because I have like a lot of clothes, but I don't have that many accessories to be honest. Those are good answers. Hello. Thank you for being in the video. Yeah, thank you for having me. So what are you wearing today? Let us know where your outfit is. Uh, so this skirt, I thrifted the Goodwill bins as long as the, as well as this. This shirt is Reformation. This, I thrifted and my boots are new rock. I really want rain boots and I've been looking at so many. I don't know, like I've seen them on the street, like fashion week. Okay. And I think that's something that I'm definitely gonna buy this winter or like fall. My name is Emmy Larson. I'm a fabric styling major. Uh, I think we're still figuring it out. We don't really know yet. Um, it's a work in progress for sure. <laughs> I definitely take like a little bit of each character um, I don't know who I'm channeling today, but usually it's a mix of share with something a little more edgy. <laughs> um, no, it's definitely been influenced since I got to FIT. I've definitely had a safe space to express myself and wear whatever I want. I don't really feel like I'm doing too much. So yeah, I have a lot of fun dressing up for class here. Oh my. I'm, I'm on a maxi skirt wave as you guys can see. So any maxi skirts, any belts, accessories, I don't really think I have I can't think of anything on the spot right now, but definitely maxi skirts and heavy accessories. We are back for another Skillshare integration because we love them and we want you to start using it because it's perfect for everybody. <laughs> right, so if you've been living under a rock or you're a new subscriber mine, you would know that I love Skillshare and I've been using it for over two years now, so way, way before I start working with them. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of online classes. When I started using Skillshare, uh, it was because I wanted to learn more about graphic design. I was starting my freelancing journey. But nowadays, I actually use it to kind of as a self-care tool, kind of as an inspiration tool. I learned about fashion. I've learned about graphic design, motion graphics, illustration, sewing. This week I actually took the class called Self-Care Through Creativity, Turn Your Anxiety Into Art by Sarah Beth Morgan. As soon as I started the class, I fell in love with the illustrations and animations that are part of it. As someone that works in a creative space, there comes a point where it starts to become really hard to detach 
your creativity with your work and your due dates and your responsibilities. I really identified myself with the author because she was also talking about you know how she's freelancing and the struggles and the anxieties that come with it. So yeah, you can now take this class for free by using the link in my description box and you'll also receive tens of thousands of additional classes for a whole month. So if this whole idea sounds appealing to you and you want to try Skillshare out, click the link in my description box. And now, back into the video. Hi Anna, um, I'm an illustration major. I'm supposed to be a junior but I'm kind of going through sophomore year right now because I transferred and everything. My style has been not the same for a while. Um, I got this back in 2020, this little skirt. Um, I got these last year, I think, um, during the winter time. It was just like I wanted to wear a lot of skirts, but I also wanted to stay warm. So I was wearing a lot of mini skirts and just this. Um, Literally, I just wanted to be comfortable today. <laughs> I usually kind of go all out on days that I'm not like painting. I think these shoes were given to me because I don't have any sneakers right now. It's mostly stuff on Depop and just stuff I find like, I usually shop a lot on eBay too. You, you know, if you see something that you like on another site but it's a little bit too expensive or you just see, you know, an image or something that you really want, you can probably find something similar on there and if you just like look up little keywords I honestly look up like I've been really into like lace lacy and like very dainty dresses so I'll just look up like you know like frilly frilly skirt dress my name is Tyler and my major is fashion design this is my second year I would definitely say it is improved I feel like I've always had good style but I am definitely elevating it now that I'm here in New York. The places that I've been shopping have been different because before I used to be like going to fast fashion. I know it's really bad. Um, all the stores have become like thrifting and or luxury stores. I'm not sure. I really want like either a Dior bag or maybe some kind of Balenciaga pants because I've seen like these wax denim jeans that they have. Those are really, really cute. So we'll see. Today I am wearing uh, Jordans and I am Gia pants. I don't know where this tank top is from. And then I have a Balenciaga bag. Love the bag. And then some crystal pearls. Thank you. Alrighty, so this was the video. Thank you to everyone for being in my video and being nice to me because it can be very intimidating to interview people in the street. And yeah, um, follow my Myazine Spotify playlist down below if you want to see the music that I use in my videos. Follow me on Instagram, Myazine's Instagram. I think that's everything. So yeah, I'll see you next Sunday. Bye!